Welcome, guys. Continuing our Final Fantasy VIII playthrough. We just got the garden off. Survived the missiles coming from Galbadia. A little bit adrift. Let's see. Where will we stop? No one knows. Well, I kind of know, but yeah. I think we were showing Renoa around. We all good either health wise, yep. Renoa should have, yep. Alright, sweet. Let's do this. This place is huge. Do you think it's bigger than Galbadia Garden? Who knows? Where do we want to take her? What's over here? The cafeteria. What about over there? The parking lot. Squall, I really appreciate you showing me around. I'm not really doing that. Good job. But can you try to make it a little more fun? You know, like a normal tour? What does she want from me? Go here. I don't remember where the pink, the pink area is. Sick dude on a guitar. I'm worried about mom and pop back in Bala. But I knew a time like this would come eventually. You knew that that guy would miraculously start flying and end up in the ocean? What? <laughs> the time for me to embark on a never ending journey. The boundless ocean. I wonder what's to become of us. Don't think we'll be graduating for a while. I don't mind. Just enjoy the moment. Wish we could go far, far away. I mean, when you think about it, we did just like kind of semi kidnap a bunch of uh, school students who aren't soldiers. I mean, we kind of protected them as well, but still. remember where I'm supposed to take her. Oh. Student ID number 41269. Squall? Yes. The garden master wishes to see you. Report to the master's room right away. Where is the master's room? Take the elevator to level B1. You have permission. Oh, this is where you meet Norg. If I fight him with two people. I think we give you magic, because otherwise we might be in problem. some trouble. She has four cures, three cures. That's not good. I really gotta do some grinding as soon as the garden is able to, like, actually move, like you control it. What is this place? Please, listen to me. Headmaster's here? Hey, there's Zell. Now we do it with three. What are you guys doing down here? What? Oh, me. They came down because I saw you guys. Let go of me. I'm not finished. Greedy son of a bitch. Why did I even bother talking to you? See, were brought up for the future. And that future is now. Why can't you understand? Damn it. should never have trusted you. I wish I could go back ten or so years. Sorry, voice. Tell myself that you're nothing but a money-grubbing son of a bitch, then I would never have built this place. What's going on, Headmaster Sid? Squall! You heard everything? 
Yes. I'm embarrassed, but sometimes even old men like me lose their temper. Let's get out of here. Nah, I'm gonna go see Norg. Oh. Sir, I still have to give you my report. Please come to my office later. Jesus. You're the seeds you returned from Galbadia, correct? Yes. It's about time. Master Nork has been waiting for you. Come. I think there's a save before you fight him. Or there's not. Whenever Master Nork calls you, be sure to be there within three seconds. Three seconds are up. This is the Garden Master, the proprietor of Garden? He's not human, come to think of it, we didn't know anything about him. What a shock. <laughs> Vishifuru, Vishifuru, give your report on the sorceress. Now where do I start? Answer him quickly, be concise. We failed to assassinate Sorceress Edia. It's going to be a sad report. Confirmation of Headmaster Sid's order was made at Galvadia Garden. After Irvine Kines of Galvadia Garden joined our party, we set off to carry out the Sorcerer Assassination Order from Balam and Galvadian Gardens. Rajurururu, Balam and Galvadian's orders! Rajurururu, you were fooled. Fooled? I don't understand. Explain to them. Oh, I, there's a uh, mod that I put on Skyfire Prime that uh, ups the textures, so it did the, does the text as well. That's why the characters look a bit better, too. Master Nork has known about the alliance between the President of Galbadia and the Sorceress. He heard it from the Galbadian Garden Master himself. The Galbadian Garden Master? Bashururururu. The master of Galvadia Garden is a subordinate of mine, named Martin. Yes, in fact, the sorceress and garden are closely connected. That is why the sorceress will definitely try to gain hold of all gardens. So Master Norg sent an official order to Galvadia Garden. It was to kill the sorceress, and assassinate was assassination was thought to be the best means. But, but you're, man, that's real weird to say every time. That sly weasel Martin used you as a last resort for the assassination. He gave that order to place the blame on me. Man, that bad bastard guy is not very cool under pressure. Are you saying that Balam had nothing to do with that order? You just happened to show up just before the mission was to be carried out. They used you. But the operation failed. The sorceress is still alive and... The sorceress retaliated, just as we suspected. No doubt it was the sorceress who ordered the missile attack. Bleh. Something must be done to calm the sorceress anger. Wait a minute, that's just... In order to do so, we need to hand over the involved in, in the assassination to the sorceress. We had to show Balam Garden sincerity. Offer the seed's head on a silver platter and pretend we obey the sorceress. What? Yeah, that's not happening, dude. Why aren't we fighting the sorceress? What about all the training we endure every day? What good is it? What did you say? You lost to the sorceress. Quit your whining. I think we won, but we lost in a cutscene. So, nah. And Master Sid was saying the same thing. Hey. But sure, oh, they ran away. Sid? That idiot Sid dispatched Seed to kill the sorceresses. And if you fail, this garden will be done for. My garden, it will all be over. 
That idiot Sid, has he forgotten that it was I who put up the money to establish Garden? I wanted to offer the sorceress Sid's head along with seeds. I ordered the students to find Sid, but they sided with him. This is my garden. Man, this guy's super possessive. No, not just yours. Then what is it? Is it Sid's and Edia's? That pathetic married couples? Oh, I didn't know they were married. What? The headmaster and Edia are married. Wait, no, that is a big thing. I remember that. I don't get it. Now I understand. Sid and Edia are trying to take Garden away from me. He just seems like a crazy old dude. <laughs> you are one of Sid's followers, aren't you? Prepare to die. Oh. Okay, that was not a save. We have to fight him. I have to go back to... The... Friggin' infirmary. Oh no, my room. Scroll's room. Blue, yellow, red. Lots of magic when red. As long as color stays, I will attack seeds with magic. Oh shit, I got a draw. What do I have to wait? I gotta wait till it opens. I think you just hit the shield until it breaks. And you just make sure that the lights aren't yellow. I mean red. Because when they're red, he casts a lot of magic. I think? We'll find out. Well, I know when it's both red, he said he casts a lot of magic, and he says blue, yellow, red, so... I don't know, we'll find out. I've got thunder. I suppose if it's yellow, he's weak to lightning. No, that was wrong. Plus, I'm supposed to hit the light, uh, yeah, the light with it. I think we'll scan him and find out. Yeah, I think I can remember that promise from Ben. Yeah, you've got to just destroy the shelter. I missed how much health it had. Oh, it's nearly dead. Just 
just got to make sure he doesn't have two red lights up. That 58 damage crit. I need to, uh... Or get better weapons. I still haven't got like these are the first weapons. Still haven't upgraded them at all. Uh, I couldn't change it twice. I thought I could change it twice. Oh wait, no, I did. Let's go blue, yellow, red. You went blue, yellow, blue. I've got the weapons monthly to do it. I just need to get the stuff. All right, now I'm gonna draw from Norg to get Leviathan. Damn those seeds! Oh, I missed what else he said. Oh, I think when you attack it, it just goes back to blue. I should put, um, I'm going to put shell on everyone. Yes, 9k. Fucking T-Rex. No, wait, did I? No, I didn't. Well, I did. I beat one T-Rex. I used GF on the wrong person. Oh, I fucked the boost up. Boost! Come on, Ifrit. And 120's good. For Ifrit. Concentrating on doing the draws. That's not too bad, but starting to be so late. Oh right, he's weak. Do it on Squall, do it. Yes, just don't kill him. Just want to get Renzo Kugan.
Grand Bay being a lot harder, and I kicked the shit out of me when I was younger, and I did this. Then again, when I was younger, I didn't fucking uh, use shell or anything like that. I was like, nah, fuck defensive spells. <laughs> Gotta be nearly dead. There we go. I'm done for. I'm afraid of you. Me? Why me? But you were gonna kill us. Oh fuck yeah, Carl won't be using blend counter. What the hell was that? Forget about it for now. I can't believe you said that. I think what just happened is really serious. What's the point of talking about it now? You don't know what's going on either. What's that draw point? This is crazy. I don't know what's going on anymore. I feel like a helpless puppet being manipulated in some major scheme. Well, so I was kind of just there. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to see the headmaster. Oh, bio. That's not that great. Thought it'd be something cool. Alright, what do I need for this? No, April's not the... June's the latest one. The Trail Sword, I don't know where I get that. Turtle Shell and Screws. I've got the Screws, I don't know if I've got the Turtle Shell though. No, I don't have a Turtle Shell. To fight on the beaches and find out where I get a Betrayal Sword from. Up to the top. Oh, he's not here. What? This is his office. Alright, I'm confused. I'm gonna get save anyway. Yeah, I used too many GFs that time. I thought I was gonna lose a seed level. Hey, that kid's back to jogging or running. Good for you, kid. I should junction Leviathan to someone. It's cool. Auto potion. 
Friend boost first anyway. Great conversation with that guy. Random small child. Dead master. I haven't seen him. Of course you haven't. Said he was in his office and he wasn't up there. What is this? For over there, I was quite worried. I doubt they can't go out under these circumstances. Stay indoors, why don't you? Jesus, old man. Kind of rude. Alright, well, we're looking for the headmaster then. Infirmary, maybe? He was injured. Well, he got thrown. Yeah. Well, the headmaster is kind of... I'm okay now, doctor. Sweet! Are you sure? Yes, I believe I'm done crying. Oh, Let's take it easy, okay? He's got a lot on his mind. Let's go in there. I killed Nork. He's dead. You all s see me in such an embarrassing state. What shall we talk about? I want to make a report. I want to make a report. No, no, it's not necessary. I can guess what must have happened. Shall we talk about the real meaning of seed? Please tell me the real meaning of seed. Seed is seed, the elite mercenary force of Balam Garden. Do you know something about seed? I never know anything. <laughs> seed will defeat the sorcerers. The garden will train seed members. The many missions around the world are only training for the final battle against the sorcerers. But now that the sorceress has become a major threat, our true mission has begun. Okay. That sorceress, Edia. Please tell me about Edia. I heard she's your wife. You're quite right. She had been a sorceress since childhood. I married her knowing that. We were happy. We worked together. The two of us. We were very happy. One day, Edia began talking about building the garden and training seed. I became obsessed with that plan. But I was very concerned with Seed's goal, that one day Seed might fight Edia. She laughed and told me that would never happen. However... However what? You just trailed off! Tell me about Master Nork. He is from the Shumi tribe, a black sheep of the tribe one might say. We met while I was running around trying to find funds to build the garden. He became interested in building the garden and we hit it off. Thanks to his funding, it was completed. However, we needed an enormous amount of funds to run the garden. We began dispatching seeds around the world as a means of supporting the garden. Norg's idea was right on the money. An enormous amount of capital began flowing into the garden. And the garden began to change. Lost sight of our high ideals, the truth was covered up. That's probably enough. In the end, it was my fault for giving up control. He's dead now. All right. What to do next? What to do we do now? We must stop drifting around soon. I only hope that we can get things back to the way they were. Is that it? What do I do now? Just wait for the frickin' thing to crash? No, I can't get out of that without talking to him again. What is it? Are you injured again? That's not very nice. Sounds like I get injured all the time. I think I go rest or something? Maybe?
I meant to say don't rest and save, but oh well. No, nope, I didn't do anything. Alright, we found the... The headmaster. He literally didn't tell us anything. Maybe we go up to these office again and have a look at the controls or something. I don't remember this part of the game. I know where we crash, but I don't remember how we get it to crash there. Oh, there we go. Squall, squall. Have you seen the headmaster around? He's at the infirmary. Sounds like trouble, what's wrong? Go to the second floor deck and see for yourself there's a ship approaching. Could be Galvanians or worse, the sorceress might be aboard. Come to attack us. Have to tell the headmaster right away. Oh, I don't remember this part. To the second floor we go. Second floor. I think my follower thing didn't proc, because I have another follower. Thank you if you followed. Frickin' Streamlabs, man. It's supposed to have a thing pop up. A ship? A Galbadian ship? It's Headmaster Sid here. Is Headmaster Sid here? No, he's not here. Are you from Galbadia? We are Seeds. This is Edia's ship. We are Sorceress Edia's Seed. Seed? We're coming abroad. We're unarmed. Aboard, not abroad. Man, they can jump, Jesus! Please, we come in peace. That's all it takes. We must speak to Headmaster Sid. Where is he? I'm right here. Headmaster, we've come from alone. It's too dangerous here now. We'll come for alone. Yes, I'm afraid so. Alone, that girl from Wind Hill? Well, you know who she is. Please go find her. She's here somewhere in the garden. Who are these guys? How are they connected? Squall? Yes, sir. Thank you for the great directions. She's somewhere in the garden. Please bring her here. I'll help you too. How's that helping? Squall, alone's that girl, huh? You know, that little girl Laguna was taking care of. Probably. If she's in the garden, where is she? Let's split up and find her. Hey Squall, who's alone? He's a person in the dream world. You don't even know what she looks like, Renoa. You're kind of useless here. Hell, I don't even know where to start looking for her. That's some bad conveyance, that's what that is. Unless it's just a trigger thing when I walk somewhere. Be in the infirmary. I doubt that'd make you go to the um, training grounds with just one person. Let's try out here.
Nope. she be in the dormitory? I doubt it. Cafeteria, maybe? No. I don't think I've ever talked to these people. No more hot dogs today. Aww. I've worked here for many a year now. I must say, being young is so great. Like this burst of energy flowing within you, constantly, and... I'll end it here. But seriously, with all these youngsters around, I'm beginning to feel young myself. I'm starting to think, thinking to myself, hey, I'm still all that, you know what I mean. Ha 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 ha, what am I saying, ha 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 ha. Well anyway, I have a son about your age, but he is just so incompetent, and oh my god. So my son, he's not as bright as all you here, so... I was worried about his future, then about a year ago. I'm going on a journey to see what I can do, he said. Can you believe him? I was really surprised at first, but my son had this serious look I've never seen before. So I built up enough courage and told him to go for it. Well, when I look back at it now, all he did was make my husband and me worry. But now, my, has he matured? He's grown up, I tell you. It sure gets lonely without him. Oh my, I'm sorry, I got carried away. Whenever I see you youngsters, I just get nostalgic. I wonder where he is now. Damn it, there was no payoff. I thought she was going to give me an item at least. Fuck. <laughs> Check the dormitories, but I doubt she's in here. I actually, thinking about it, I think she's in the fucking infirmary. check the infirmary and then if she's not there then she's definitely in the like training room or something because I think the only other rooms is like the library and the garage alright that was wrong oh there was another room and she was in it Nope. Alright. Got the library, the training room, and another room. The lady who went to the library gave me some set. Yes, yeah, library. I was one away, and then I thought, oh no, she's definitely in the infirmary. That was silly. That's the garage. I thought that was a library. That's a training one. This must be the library. I do not know the layout of this place. There we go. Alone. All grown up. This is the second time you've seen her all grown up. Yes, Squirrel. Are you alone? Yes. You're alone. Be alone. What is going on? You know Laguna, don't you? I do. I really love Uncle Laguna. And tell me, what is it that we experience? I'm sorry, Skull. It's hard to explain. But one thing. It's about the past. So we were viewing the past. Well, obviously she's grown up there, Squall. Put two and two together, man. People say you can't change the past. But even still, if there's a possibility, it's worth a try, right? Change the past? Is she serious? Give me a break.
Are you the one responsible? Are you the one taking us to that dream world? I'm sorry. Not again. So much I don't understand. Why me? I have enough problems as it is. Don't get me involved in this. I'm sorry. Don't. Don't count on me. Oh, Squall. Hey, there's Zoo. Well, did you find alone? She's right there, you, you blind lady. Um, I'm alone. Are you alright? What alone said under her breath was... You're my only hope. Why do people depend on each other? In the end, you're on your own. He's such a melancholy teenager. <laughs> I've made it this far by myself. Happy though? Sure, I couldn't do a thing when I was a kid. I've depended on others, but... Yeah, he's depended on others, but... It's a pretty cool ship. But we have to find that later. Remember that taking me forever to find, too. I'll be the first one to admit that I'm here because of other people. I'm fine by myself now. I have all the skills I need to survive. I'm not a child anymore. That's a lie. I don't know anything. I'm confused. <laughs> Fucking hell, Squall. You're a mess. I don't want to depend on anyone. How can I do that? Someone tell me. Someone. So I'll end up depending on others after all? Sis. I'm all alone, but I'm doing my best. Hang in there, tiny squall. I'll be okay without you, sis. I'll be able to take care of myself. Oh. Hey again. I wasn't asleep. You can't say I was asleep. Oh really? I think I heard you talking in your sleep. I'm not telling you what you said. Hey, let's go for a walk. Again? That was a guided tour. This time, it's a walk. Big difference. Let's go by yourself. It's safe here. It's not that I want a guard with me. You know, you're always so too deep in thought. Why don't you lighten up a little? It's not good to think too much. What I'm trying to say is, it would be my honor to have your company, your highness, <laughs> in hope that I may get your mind off things. How about it, your highness? I'll play along. Fine. Thank you, your highness. All right, let's get going. Fuck yeah, Ronella. No, I'm not on the save point. I do save quite a lot because I hate redoing things, so... If something does happen, I don't want to redo that bit again. Um, um. Hello everyone, this is the Headmaster speaking. The lines have been fixed and I'm glad to be back on the air. Hurrah! Um. Whoa! Oh, here we go. Boy, it's a slow day. Come on, give me a big one. Well, you got your wish. Life or fish, old man. Make a choice.
Well, this is the headmaster speaking. Please come to my office. Repeat, please come to my office right away. And you think there'd be, like, more senior seed members he'd call on? Everybody, please remain calm. Also, please do not leave the garden under any circumstances until you are permitted. We will try to get things back in order ASAP. Thank you for your cooperation. Ah, oh, Squall, thank you for coming. Here are your orders. We've landed on Fisherman's Horizon. Please go ashore with Zell and Renoa. Find the local mail and apologize for this accident. Tell them that we came in peace. Take a look around the city while you're at, you're there too. Yes, sir. Why do I have to go? Do you have something you want to tell me? No. Seed is not just a special force for combat. I want you to see the world. To broaden your horizons. I have high expectations of you, Squall. Headmaster Sid. Whoops. Now go. I keep... I read the fucking title thing sometimes. Bad. What's up? Are we going to Fisherman's? We're here. We'll, we'll land at Fisherman's Horizon. We'll make an official apology, then observe the town. Yo, go to the second floor deck to get to Fisherman's. Front gate's closed. And we're off. Second floor. Very quiet. There's not even like any atmospheric music. It's a bit odd. Game. Hey, it's the running kid. I wonder what's going to happen if I open this door. It says do not open, so I'm kind of curious. I feel like we open that later. I'm sure, we do. Here they come. Come to warn you before you go ashore. Do not engage in any type of armed conflict in the city. We do not tolerate belligerence here. Do you understand? Yes. We are representatives of the garden and we come in peace. Welcome to Fisherman's Horizon. We call it FH. You should go visit the mayor. His house is in the middle of the city. He's the head of FH. We'll do just that. Good. Looks like we understand each other. Man, this is a hell of a mess. Terribly sorry. It was inevitable. We lost control of the garden. Nah, don't worry about it. What's important is that nobody got hurt. We love fixing stuff anyway. Think back and enjoy your stay. Man, it's a, it's a pretty chill city. We literally crashed into the city and they're pretty chill. We're just like, yeah, it's cool. We love fixing shit anyway. I thought he was shaking his head because I was... Like, couldn't move. Hey, that's Bellum Garden, right? Yes, it is. That's right, how did you know? From those patterns on the wall. We painted it a long time ago. Those were the good old days. Tell the mayor I said hi. Yo, let's go. Pretty sure FH built the garden. Oh, I got another seed fucking thing. That fucking building in the center would be so hot. I heard Balam Garden lost control. That's why you have to keep up with your maintenance. Good stuff, old man. Cheers for the advice. Yes, we're going down. Okay, our familiar face. Couldn't even give him a name. So, you guys going to Essa? Essa? You know, that high-tech city. It's just beyond the train tracks. I guess you're not going there. A lot of people who stop here go there. The trains are down, so the best way to get there is walk from here. What a joke, huh? Anyway, you guys had an accident and came here, huh? I guess I shouldn't keep you. Okay, get on. 
foreshadowing. Pretty sure we walk the train tracks. To get to Esther City. Can't remember why we do, but I'm pretty sure we do. Are you a seed by any chance? Yes. I heard that you guys are like mercenaries and basically fight anybody for money. Are you happy with that kind of life? What's his problem? Is he trying to pick a fight? Never mind. The way you live your life is none of my business. Just don't cause us any problems. He sounds just like me. I guess it doesn't sound very nice. Yes, yeah, Quill. Cool. Learn from that. There's the mayor's house. You see it? Man, Fisherman's Horizon is very small, actually. happened since then. Banished from Galbadia Garden. Everything I built up gone. After wandering around mindlessly, people of this town welcomed me with open arms. The town's people encouraged me to start over. Very kind. Even towards a man like me who has nothing. I, I'm so ashamed. Uh, yeah, you're the dude who sent us on that assassination mission. Garden Master of Galvadia. Well, you were, you're not anymore. I swear there was a draw point here. Oh well. It was something good, too. Looking around. Can't interact with anything. Upstairs we go. He seems pretty chill. Please, have a seat. Allow me to get to the point. When are you leaving? <laughs> He's not wasting any time. We'll have leave as soon as the garden is capable of moving. Any idea when? Afraid not. We only discovered that our garden is mobile a short while ago. Therefore, we didn't even know how to move it. We're still in the process of understanding everything. Our technicians will assist you. They should be able to repair and service everything. How does that sound? It means we'll have a, to let outsiders into the garden. I can't make this decision alone. Go consult with your leader if you don't have the authority. Excuse me, why do you want us to leave so bad? Please just keep your mouth shut. They must have their reasons, who cares? We don't want military organizations in FH. You rely on force to solve problems. That is in direct defiance of our principles. We believe that any problem can be settled by discussion. If you reach a mutual understanding, there is no need to fight. No argument there. Right and dull as hell, though. Violence only leads to more violence. We believe your presence here will attract violence. That's why we want you to leave as soon as possible. Let's go back to garden. That uh, was a trek to just do to be told, hey, can people come on your gar on the garden to fix it? And for you to be like, yes or no, but you can't because you're not in charge. Man, that geezer pissed me off, Squall. Why don't you tell him off? Can I talk to you? No. Oh, you're just going to talk while we're running, obviously. You get it. You can't expect everyone to welcome us. He's not wrong. G -g 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 Galbadian soldiers. No worries, man. Cheers for watching. Wait. The Galvadians are here because of you, right? They're after you. Maybe. You better take full responsibility. It's your fault. Fine, we'll take care of them. I don't like the sound of their tone. Her tone, though. You mustn't rely on them. They won't be able to do anything without fighting. Don't tell me he's going to try to reason with them. I'll go talk to them. He's dead.
save point and a draw point. Regen. Regen's good. Uh, Renoa. Oh, this is the town. He looked, looked a bit gloomy, the mayor. Which way did he go there? I saw the mayor walking towards the station alone. Did you guys have anything to do with it? Where is the station? Just keep going straight and you'll run into it. What does Boatman have to say? Hey, what's up with all these soldiers and war machines? They just keep coming from over there. I can't get into the pub. Oh well. There he is. Kills me to help that old part. Why are they wasting their time with the old man if they're after us in our garden? Wonder what they're talking about. I already told you. I've never heard of this girl alone. There's nobody here by that name. Alone? Fine. We'll just have to torch this city. Wait a minute. I'm telling the truth. I've never seen this girl. Doesn't matter, old man. Are we going to burn this place anyway? Idiot's orders. <laughs> no, please. I beg if you don't. I'll start with you. Maybe we better go now. Yeah, we better. Don't want the old man dying. Alright, let's get on it. Who the hell are you? The seeds. Seeds? Get the ironclad over here. Sorry, but we have no choice. Squall. Probably draw from them, see if they've got anything. Nah, uh, nothing new. Oh, he has Vera, Thunderer, and Cura. goes into the algorithm that tells them how many I draw. Because sometimes you'll draw two, sometimes they'll draw eight. I 
probably do like 1k if I actually had a better weapon. <laughs> yes, Somebody's coming. Oh hey, it's the thing I beat the shit out of. Surprise it can jump like that though. Alright, first things first, scan. Seven point five K. Can only fight for a short amount of time. I mean, why wouldn't they repair it? Oh, yes, counter. Probably should have used Kira. for some reason.
It's actually a decent tick. what's gonna happen. Them on Quistus. No, I'm gonna fucking give him that strength bonus so he gets one for every time he levels. Hey, hey, we're all back together. Squall! Yes, they're all right. Hey, Selfie. Quistus, Irvine. It's great to see you guys. Say, what happened to the garden? A lot has happened. The garden is safe. Really? Woohoo! What happened to you guys? Yeah, let's talk about that later. I guess. Zell, Renoa, why don't you guys take them back to the garden? See you guys later after I take a look around. Um, alright. Why aren't you talking to me? Oh. You know. You just surprised me. You looked and sounded so happy to see them. Huh? It was the first time I've seen you so honest. It was really sweet. I was really glad to see them. It was because I felt responsible. Fuck it. I was glad to see them. I was just happy to see them, that they were alright. What's so surprising about that? There's something wrong. No, there's nothing wrong. They're your comrades, but moreover, they're your friends. Friends, huh? Hey Squall, would you have been worried about me too, you know, if I were with them instead? What? Why is she asking me this? I don't know. I, uh, don't know, um, maybe? I don't know. Oh my gosh, you're turning red. What? No I'm not! You're so cute, taking it so seriously. The heck? Why is she toying with me? Catch you later, Squall. Ah, Squall. So naive. <laughs> I guess you saved my life. Sorry for butting in. No, but I'm not thanking you. You don't have to, it's just that. I wish you could be a little more understanding about us. We're not just a bunch of warmongers. Oh. It's hard for me to explain. I wish everything could be settled without resorting to violence, and there would be no need for battles. Like you've been preaching, it would be wonderful if things could be settled by discussion. The only problem with that is, it often takes too much time, especially if the others are not willing to listen. But I believe that fighting is inevitable at times. It's really sad. That's all I have to say, I hope you understand someday. 
I think the world needs both people like you and people like us. Thank you for all your help. Goodbye. They say something, dude. Back to the garden. Alright, I'm going the wrong way. Way? Oh, the draw point hasn't come back. Damn. Off we go. Wish they didn't put this elevator in. <laughs> Anything where I have to talk to someone and like go up an elevator is the worst. What, you don't remember me? You just met by your garden's entrance. Is it him? Lucy, I'm sorry. Can't believe it, oh well. I'm operating the sleep with my brother. You saw him up there, right? Uh, oh yeah. Don't we look alike? Man, what's wrong with you? Oh well. Let me know when you want to go up. That's literally what I was doing. Okay. Get on. Here we go. Slowly. Gotta talk to Irvine. Headmaster gave the okay to let the technicians in the garden. They're in there right now. Okay. They. Yeah. Uh, I was wondering. Those technicians seem very handy. They're like, would it be alright if I asked them to fix some other stuff? As long as it doesn't slow down the work on the garden, go ahead. Try not to ask for too much. Yeah, of course. Are you in my party now? When did that... Okay. What? Belfie's feeling down right now. I sure thought I should let you know since you're kind of like everybody's leader. I think you should go talk to her. I know you're a klutz when it comes to these things, so I'll back you. <laughs> issue. He's hanging out at the stage by the squad. Wow. They expect all this heavy machinery. How else are they going to repair it? With hammers and nails? Hey, 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 this isn't my department. Then what is? Guns and women, of course. Oh, fine. You... Weird-ass guy. Can't remember what his, like, ultimate weapon looks like. I know I've, I had Zells, and I had... What's-her-face? Quistuses. I think I had Renoas, and I had Squalls when I played through when I was younger, but I don't think I got Irvines. Uh, where was the quad? I think it's this one. I had like the old font without the mod on. That was weird. Oh, 
Oh, this does, like, it has a mixture of the old font. Boo, this is so bad. Yeah, it's been crazy with the garden moving and crashing into FH. A lot's happened. You know, I really wanted to see a band perform on this stage. Even had my eyes set on a few people, too. Oh well. Cheer up. Come on. I'm sure you can still do something. Well, being sensitive? That's weird. You're the last person I expected to cheer me up. Must really look depressed. Oh. What's so weird? I can't just like everyone else. Man, that, that weird font is really annoying me. Just that there are too many things that can't be helped. So why bother talking about everything? Uh-oh. There you go again into your own little world. And you're not going to share anything, huh? Yeah, whatever. <laughs> why is she teasing me? I was just trying to help. Well, I think I'm feeling better. Don't worry about me, Squall. Irvine, you help her. I'm out of here. Alrighty. Oh, this is the headmaster speaking. Please come to my office. What now? I guess there's no point feeling blue. That's right, let's get the fun started. Fun? What fun? I'm so brilliant. So like, first we'll ask the FH technicians if they can fix the stage. If they can fix the garden, this should be a piece of cake for them. Hmm, do you think they'll do it? Don't worry, I'll back you. I'm sure they'll do it. Hey, that means... Yup, you can have your band perform on the stage. Woohoo! Alright, let's get this show on the road. Score, baby. I'm all set to make my move. God damn it, Irvine. That about covers my report, sir. I must have said. I did it again. I see, I also heard a report from Selfie just a moment ago. He said their diary is open to everyone to see. Maybe you should have a look. Oh, and one more thing. It appears that the Garbadians were searching for a loan. That seemed to be their main objective in FH. I believe the sorceress Edio is behind all this. The loan has the ability to allow people to experience the past. Maybe the sorceress is after her for this ability. What other reasons could there be? So now the Galvadians are working for the sorceress and we're searching for a loan in FH. And we're searching, my bad. And regardless of whether they found her or not, they had orders to burn the city down. That would help reduce the number of potential places where she could hide. That's right. Most likely the sorceress will not stop this onslaught until alone is found. She will continue to hunt her and burn everything in her path. We can't wait any longer. So he's finally going official, about time. This is Headmaster Sid. I have an announcement to make. I have important news that I must share with all of you. The garden is being repaired right now. We'll leave FH immediately after it's finished. We're going on a journey. This is a journey to defeat the sorceress. Garden will not be used as a mobile base, or will now be used as a mobile base. The administration of Garden will be run by myself and the staff, as usual. This journey will involve many battles. A well-qualified leader is needed for this. Therefore, I am appointing Squall as your new leader. What? From now on, Squall will be the leader. He will decide our destination and battle plan. Are you serious? Everyone, please follow his orders. I can't believe this. If there are any objections, please come see me in person. I don't even have a choice. Squall, we're under your command from now on. This is your fate. It is your destiny to lead the way in defeating the sorceress. Don't talk about this like it's been decided since my birth. I don't mind fighting the sorceress. It's unavoidable as long as I'm a seed member. What? As long as I'm a seed member? What if I quit? Quit? Then what? What do I have left? Don't even want to think about it. Just stop thinking. I'll just have to do as I was told. Command the garden and kill the sorceress. <laughs> Great leader. How does Headmaster Seed expect me to take care of everyone? 
It'd be best to go fight the sorcerer soon and end the nonsense. But isn't she the headmaster's wife? He wants us to kill his wife. The feel like to give an order like that. Hey everyone. Here's our producer, Selfie. Ahem. We'll be holding the concert as planned. The performance isn't just for us, though. It's also for Squall, you know, to congratulate him on his recent promotion. Sounds fun. So who's going to perform? We are. Yeah, right. You're kidding. Oh, no way. You can count me out. I have no musical aptitude. Um, two seconds. Oh, really? I gotta see this. Let's just give it a try. We have everything ready and all we need is four people. It's gonna be fun. Oh, sorry, Renoa, but you're not gonna be a member. Aw. Oh. You're leaving me out? Uh-huh. We have something more important for you to do. What are we gonna do? I mean, basically, we're all amateurs, right? Hold on a second, sorry. Even if you ha hand us instruments, we won't be able to do anything. First, I want to ask you guys something. Okay, you know I took over this event after I transferred to Balam, right? I have the composition that the last producer recommended to me, but everything's got all messed up after the garden started moving. There's supposed to be only four scores that would go with the composition, but I got eight scores. Yeah. What does that mean? It's pretty simple. Four other scores from a different composition got mixed up with the four scores that Selfie had. We have to find the four original scores to perform the composition that Selfie has. Only way we're going to find them is to play all eight scores and see. So I want you guys to pick up an instrument, one person at a time, and play it. Irvine knows the composition, so he'll choose which four are the right ones. Let's get started. Alright. Who should we put, well, what should we put Zell on? Uh, sax, electric guitar, piano. How about we go saxophone? Not a bad tune. Oh, we can do stuff. Okay, sounds good. I thought we had to wait for him to finish. Irvine, what are we gonna get him to play? Piano, I think. Sure. And selfie with the electric guitar. Yeah. Okay. And twist this for some bass. And let's hope this works. Okay, we have until tonight to practice for the performance. Renoa, that's when you're up. 
you can count on me. It's gonna be a blast. I'm bored. What's everybody doing? Not hanging out with you all. That's what they're doing. I probably should have saved on a different slot so I could change it if I fucked it up. Shit, here he comes. Okay, he's all yours. Nice little white dress. No, <laughs> you can't walk past her. <laughs> You're not going anywhere. So what's up? I... <laughs> so down. Come on, Squirrel. How old are you? You're still a teenager. Why don't you act like one for a change? Just tired. Oh, come on. Let's go to the concert. I don't know. Why not? Yes, okay, let's go. So she convinced you, eh? Looking good together. So, like, I found this place. It's perfect for you guys. <laughs> Give me a break. It's by the stage. You can't miss it. I left an old magazine there. You can thank me later. Have fun. Just let it all out tonight. Oh man, this guy is sick. <laughs> Are you finished? I might be there later with a special someone too. Come on man, I'm about to make my move. What's up? Oh well. Jeez, thanks a lot. Let's go watch this rockin' concert that I put on. Should've put them all just on the same instrument. All on the saxophone. If I could. I didn't really pay attention to see if I could. Well, you big stud. This is all for you. Congratulations. Enjoy the show. For now, I don't let him get away. Whatever. Ready? A uh, one, two, three. Cells just frozen. Ah. I didn't mean to do that. Hey, that's the old magazine. Like the place he was talking about. Oh, a naughty magazine. I thought he was kidding. You wanted to talk about something, right? What is it? Um, well, it's about your promotion. Things are gonna get real tough for you, huh? I don't want to think about it. Well, I'm sure there'll be a lot of difficult things that you'll have to deal with from now on. We were talking about that and saying how you'll probably try to handle everything on your own. I probably will. They know you too well. I do too, although I haven't been around you that long. You know, when you start thinking you tend to frown like this. <laughs> I'm out of here. Oh, come on, I'm sorry. But really, you were saying that, well, you can't handle everything on your own. I'm assuming these are solar panels. That's it. Just let out anything. Anything. We want you to talk to us a little more, that's all. You know, if there's anything you want to tell us, or anything we can do, don't hesitate to let us know. I know it's not easy, but I wish you would trust us, and rely on us a little more. Am I that untrusting? Maybe I'm this way because I'm scared. Nothing lasts in this world. It feels great to have friends who believe in you, and adults you can rely on. That's why it's so dangerous, especially if you become used to it. Someday you're bound to lose everything. Everybody around you will be gone. Then what are you left with? Nothing, nobody. It's so miserable. That's inevitable. 
It's so hard to recover from something like that. I never ever wanted to deal with that again. I can't, even if it means being alone. I don't get it. What's going on? Huh? What? Oh, me. Sorry about that. So are we finished here? What? No, I didn't mean you. I was talking about the music. I love this piece, but it's been terrible for the last few minutes. Jeez, what's wrong with them? Oh, well, I'll see you later, alright. Wait, you're not getting off that easy. You still owe me an answer. Answer for what? Oh. Fine, I'll ask for your help when I really need it. I'll try to trust everybody more often. Okay. What is your problem? Why do you have to be like that? Are you mad or something? Tell me you are, because they, this really can't be you. Sorry. You're not sorry. You just want to get the hell out of here, that's all. Geez, why does it have to be like this? Why? Oh well, this won't change anything. I think I was honest. I prefer to be alone, right? Yeah. Goddamn, Squall. Messing shit up. Is it Laguna time? Sounds like it's Laguna time. Oh no, it's this. I'm all alone, but I'm doing my best. I'll be okay without you, sis. I'll be able to take care of myself. Abrupt cut in the music. <laughs> scroll, scroll, please report to the bridge immediately. What is it now? Saving. To the bridge. Sup, little bandana girl. I'm going to become a seed someday. Good on you for having a life goal. That fall. Greetings, Commander. Don't call me that. We thought you should have a title, so Quistus and I decided on Commander. Sorry to carry things out on our own, but Zoo and I assigned duties. I'll take care of all the supplies needed in the garden. And I'll ta help take care of the students with Dr. Katawaki. You could just focus on our destination and battle plans. And, uh, you let Selfie rest a while? I think she's exhausted from the missile base mission. She could use some rest. How does that sound to you? Fine. Alright, I have some reports for you already. Hey Squall. Who are you? What? Oh man, it's me. We passed the seed exam together. I can't believe you forgot. Hey, it was that random. Oh yeah. E. Well, it's just like you to forget. By the way, you know the FH technicians were fixing the garden, right? They just finished. Meaning, the garden's ready to go anytime. Oh yeah, I'll be piloting the garden. FH technicians taught me everything about piloting this thing. Let me know when you want to go. Any suggestions on where we should go? Hey, why don't we go back to Balam? We don't know what's happened. We left. Besides, Balam may be their next target. It's a harbor town, just like FH. You're right. Squall, well, what do you think? Taking off. I'll direct you to the destination. Announce the departure. Roger. May I have your attention, please? This is the bridge. The garden will be leaving FH shortly. Please prepare for departure. I will now hand the mic over to our leader, Squall. <laughs> uh. 
A speech? Forget it. Cut the mic. I wonder why you can't take selfies. Oh god, it is buttons. Button two is to get off. Back with cockpit. Um, Balam is over here. Alright, save. Well, I'm just gonna quickly check something, because I would need to make new weapons real bad. So... Oh shit, I need to do that. Dune. Where did we get Betrayal Sword from? Betrayal Sword... Eight. Blitz and Forbidden. That does not tell me much. Monster Encyclopedia. Do I have a forbidden card? God. Probably not. Lost my Ifrit. No, I don't. I can get, like, turtle shells here, I think. A little bit of grinding in the middle of... Story progression. Oh, they're not junctioned. Great. Well, at least this told me they weren't junctioned. Wait, is Squall not junctioned? Oh, it's colors. Not do much damage. I suppose it's probably because he was underground, actually. No, it still doesn't do that much. Oh, it's probably because I've got ice on the weapon or something. Elemental junction. something anyway as well. Alright, Renoa. 
You can have... Where's a cuddle? Uh, brothers. Carbuncle. GF draw card. Shiva, Siren. That's it. No, I want to attack. Uh, GF, magic, draw. He's called Squall, has item. Yep. Oh, cottages affect GFs as well. I did not know that. Battle? No, these things. I'm pretty sure you can just go rest and get yeah, um, HP and stuff back too, actually. This is like just before the end of disc two as well. Where you can fight turtles here. If I don't get one in like two more battles, we'll uh, move on. That's a fish again. I don't want to fight no fish. They're annoying. Hey, is thing I learned mug yet? Attack, isn't it? Oh, change attack to mug. Yeah. Be learning now. Learn dark side. I don't even remember what that does, but learn it. I swear you can find turtles here though.
four fish fins off one. I stole like all his fins. Yeah, I stole all his things. Other garden. I mean, if one can fly, all of them can. It's Galbadia Garden, that's the one. Alright, last one. If this is the fish again, we're just gonna go back to the garden, save, and. Yeah, it's just fish. try find a betrayal sword and another beach to see if I can find a turtle shell. Let us go rest up. under Galbadia control. What dorms is the... this one. Yeah, that's what I thought. To the bridge. We'll just go and although I think no. No no no. I have to I need to have Ragnarok by that point. I'm getting ahead of myself. I put 
the garden in the worst possible spot. Can't stop in the tree. What the hell? Oh, I missed some of that and I pressed X too soon. My bad. Yo, what's going on there? This town is under the control of Sorceress Edio. The town is off limits while we conduct our investigation. It will last for several days. Once we're through with our investigation here, you're next. So just stay out and stay put. We were forced out of town days ago. Our daughter's still at home, but there's nothing we can do. With all these soldiers from Galvadia, you've got to stop and wonder whether Galvadia fell to the hands of the sorceress. I don't know what to do, what's happening to this town. I can't go in. If I knew this was going to happen, I would have brought my daughter with me. I hope she's alright. You guys look suspicious. What are you doing here? I literally just talked to you. What's Galbadia doing in a town like this? What do you want? Are you residents here? Yeah, that's right. At least residents should be allowed in. It's off limits. You can't enter or leave. Do you understand? Huh. You think you're talking to? What? What is it now? You said the town was off limits. Does that mean we can't deliver a message either? That's too bad. We have some info on our loan. But what? Wait a minute. Tell me everything you know about her. Do you, do you actually know who she is? Kind of, but we need to get inside to confirm something. If you find out any information at all, go talk to the commander. He's staying at the hotel. You will be rewarded. Why did you take Renoa out of my party? Now I gotta make sure she's junctioned. Yeah, she's got way more health than she needs to. She's junctioned. Did not give her abilities though, because I'm an idiot. There's a way to convert your magic too, I think. Hey, if you're done with your rare errands, go home. If I see you loitering, I'll have to t take you in. Hello, Zell. I need you back. Oh god. Ah! I can make sheer trigger at least. That's a slight increase? Not great. But slight. What do you want? If it's the commander you're looking for, I have strict orders not to let anyone through. What information about alone? Hmm, more rumors. You know what? We'll get a salary cut if we let them through without confirmation. Yeah, I know. In this army, your salary gets cut based on just how the boss is feeling. I guess it goes uh, with the territory, when you can't choose your own boss. Yo, listen. We have top secret info. Bring the commander out here. Fucking Sal, you idiot. These guys are kind of suspicious, huh? Yeah, totally. Have some respect for the captain. The captain is currently on patrol. Alright. Well, I guess he's, like, down here, then. Well, yes, you're finally here. You have to go avenge my boss, so Gal Galbadians broke their arm boss's arm. All he did was ask a question. He wanted to know what was to become of Balan. Oh man, if only I were as strong as you, Zell. Ha! <laughs> sure. Just be grateful to Galbadia that this town hasn't gone up in a sea of flames. Sorceress Edia has the power to wipe this town out, you know. You heard of a name alone? Yes, I heard this through the grapevine, but it seems alone may be on a ship. There's a good chance she may have disembarked here. Well, this is a small harbour, so a small ship could have slipped in unnoticed. I bet, like, a small harbour would mean it would get noticed. You know what I think? I don't think this girl alone even exists. 
It's just an excuse for the sorceress to attack in other countries. It's just a lie. But she is the sorceress. Why would she need to tell lies? Oh, I understand. This town is safe because a loan might be here. Kind of the opposite, but... Oh. Well, where's this captain dude? He'll also take full responsibility. Go talk to the captain. I don't know where the captain is, dude. The captain's napping spot. How the hell should I know? Well, he's probably not sleeping in the street with his bulky build. You won't find him on top of a roof either. Oh, that's right. Ah, oh, I'm home. Huh? Well, the kettle's boiling. Someone should be here. Ah, oh, you're safe. Zell, so, how on earth did you get into town? It's all in the brains, Ma. We just said we had some info on a loan. Piece of cake. What a relief. I was worried you might have to beat up one of the guards. Soldiers have threatened that the sorceress will burn the town to the ground should there be any disturbance. Sorceress Edia, is she here? I noticed a woman with the Galvadian army. Great hair, patch over one eye. Must be Fujin. Who so they're here. Leave it to me. I'll get rid of those jokers. Could Cypher be here too? They say the town will be released in several days. I wonder if it's true. The whole town's on edge. The residents, the soldiers. Go up to Zell's room. Can't stay at the hotel. Ah, I guess we have no choice. Let's just go to my room and rest. It's not like I'm inviting you guys, okay? It's because we have no choice. Ah, Zell. You have guns on your wall. So this is Zell's room. Is that your grandfather, Zell? Yep, he's the person I look up to the most. He played a big role in the last war. He wasn't just strong. He knew when to attack, when to retreat. Any kind of situation, he maintained his composure and stayed cool. So basically the opposite of you. <laughs> Yo, Squall, why are you dissing me? It's probably none of my business, but... Maybe you're being a little too cool, Squall. <laughs> she got you there, Squall. Why don't you try to show a little more passion? You know, like me. Hey, the hoverboard. Well, it's good they put that in, I guess. Fucking where's Rage and Hide? Oh, it's like in between the cars, I think. What do you want? You shouldn't be walking out here. If you know anything, go to the hotel and report. I've done that. Ugh, I haven't eaten anything since yesterday with this upset stomach of mine. So hungry, can't even walk straight. Ugh. Buy up too much, use them. Oh, you're looking for someone? I heard before there was some one sleeping behind one of the army vehicles. Is that what this is about? Actually, I wanted to buy some stuff, but thank you for the info. That's it. Some tents and supplies. Draw thunder for Squall again. Up his attack. Pretty sure it's on attack. Find the car, yeah. Get in, but just go in from the back. There's something there.
Well, let me go in. What is this? You can get in, but just go in from the back. Is there something there? Oh, right, stop doing that. I've talked to you. What's it? How's it going? Is there any way I can help? Oh, who or rather, what are you? Shh. Keep your voice down, man. There's only one story here, you know. Alone. You get nothing by giving info to these Galbadian soldiers. If you find out anything, come to me. Those Galbadians have no intention of paying. I'll give you money for it. You have my word. Shh. Hey, you know where the captain is? We're here to find him to see the commander. Captain, eh? You want to know, it'll bust you. I have to eat, you know. I got three types for you. Gold, silver, bronze. I get it. Hey, thanks, man. Here's a scoop. This is the, the place where the captain used to nap. The reason why he no longer sleeps here is because the commander nearly ran him over when she went out looking in a car. But I don't think you'll find him here. It is sucked to be run over while you're sleeping. Oh, I'm totally, like, the controls are getting all weird. Um, where's the other place? I'm not giving 30,000 gil, that's ridiculous. There's another car here. What, the captain? There's no way the captain will be walking around town. So have you found out anything? Have you met the commander? God damn! Say again, why are you kids looking for the captain anyway? If you're going to raid the place, do it while you're still young. Oh, if they do that, the Galbadians will burn this town to the ground. Ah, I don't repeat the same shit. I realize the captain's not what he found in. She'd be throwing a tantrum finding out that the captain's actually taking a nap instead of being on patrol like he said. Commander's freaky way of talking. Wow, gives me the chills just thinking about it. I wonder where the captain sleeps. There's no way he'd sleep behind the car again. No way, you guys are awesome. I thought we'd have to send out the search dog again. Get pretty tired chasing after the dog. Okay then, bring the captain here for me. Damn it! No, I don't care about you fucking Galvania shit. I don't want to get behind the car. I want to know his freaking other sleeping spot. There aren't many other places you could nap. I mean, I haven't gone to the train station, but yet. It's about the only place I haven't been. Well, I got some more money. Understood, sir. The food supply will be delivered to the hotel. Yeah, that's right. Better not try to cheat us now. Listen up. Sir, sir. Be sure to keep your eyes open. The army's food supply, they cut off the town's food supply, and still they make us deliver their food. I'm hungry too, you know. And I have to deliver food? What's up with that? I get up on the train? It's gotta be a more efficient way to find this girl. Just gather everyone and tie them up, that's it. What, you got a problem with that? Foreign food just doesn't cut it for me, I think about it every time I leave home. But boy, am I hungry. I feel like I can eat anything. Maybe there's some food on the train. I can't get on the train, so you mustn't be hiding here. No, oh, right. you're not going to give me any 
anything either. Everyone's just told me where he used to sleep. Go away. What's that? Where does the captain take a nap? You know, I've been worrying that myself. Before you know it, he's nowhere in sight. Wonder if he has a secret hideout. Sitting girl, tell me. Whatever's in this store is basically all we have left. Thanks to Mrs. Dinch. There hasn't been much of a panic, but there's not much we can do. Those Galbadian soldiers, they're just trying to torture us slowly. Everyone's basically on edge. Have I missed a house? Since her parents are away, I'm packing her bag so that she'll be able to stay next door. I don't know what will become of Valab. I'm sure if the sorceress in Galbadia don't give a rotten hoot about this here town. Mummy and Daddy haven't come back. I can't take it. I can't take it anymore. Well, he's not napping in here. How much money do I have? Not enough for the 30,000. I would have. Try the silver hint, I guess. Well, thanks, man. You know how the town entrance is guarded? Well, that's actually a way to get out. I ain't saying the captain left town, just enough space for a little kid to crawl through. If you find a kid who wants to get out, this kid has to have what it takes to distract the guard. Not like just down here or something, is he? No, you can't get down there anyway. Oh, he's behind the other car. There's only one kid in town. They'll be back soon, see? Even Zell's back. Don't worry, they'll be back soon. Well, we've talked to her. Maybe it'll start a thing when I talk to the guard next. God damn! Oh. Yeah, you can't take it anymore. Go run at the guard and distract him for me. Who else is there to talk to? I should have read that, sorry. A sacrifice. Oh boy, what am I thinking? In order to get these soldiers out, we're going to have to find a substitute for a loan. A sacrifice? Oh, fuck. That, a nap. That's a possibility. But no one can find him, right? Maybe he's somewhere inconspicuous. Like where? Give me a thing. This game is not very good at giving me hints on where, how to progress in this kind of situation. You keep saying the same shit. You keep telling me how to get around the car. When he's not even there, that's like... Another person. Hmm... The draw points at least up, I think. Oh, well, there's like a hundred thunder now anyway. to Zell's parent. Oh, the, they, they're kids. Thank you for having us over during these troubled times. Zell, I'm sure the whole town is counting on you, but don't strain yourself or take any chances. But maybe just one sock in the nose might be good. 
wait, wait, wait. I thought you were concerned about me. Hey, just wait. I'll show them what I'm all about. Hello, small child. Leo Zell, I've been practicing my special move, just like for a day like this. Yeah, wow, super miracle kick. Don't worry, it's my special move, so I'll only use it only if I have to. Well, I'm off to check things out. Go, small child. Distract the guard. Don't cry. I'll sneak out and check up on him. But there's a soldier there. I'm faster than a speeding bullet. I can outrun anyone. But trust me. Gotta play this event out properly so that the kid beats up the guard. You know the place to leave town. If you guys want to leave town, you better go report on a loan. Go, child. Do your thing. Damn it. Fucking controls fucked me, so I couldn't walk. I'm gonna go talk to him again. Or just leave and come back. Hopefully it's just leave and come back. Yeah, it's just leave and come back. Go kid, do your thing. Or I've got to talk to him as he's about to go, I guess. Alright. This is not working. I've got the kid doing a thing. Just distracting the guard. But now what do I do? Ah, I keep fucking screen transitioning. Just distract the thing till for a while and see if that helps. Thanks, man. I was able to talk to the hotel man while you distracted the guard. Next time I'll take care of everything. Just give me a holler when you want to leave town. So relieved after hearing from the big bad rascal that my daughter is safe. I wish I could be with her. I'm worried about Grandpa. Still very worried. Oh, please watch over her for me. I feel like that thing is just so I can leave down, and I don't need to leave down. I just need to find where fucking region is. Alright, I'm caving. I'm looking up. Where is region? Balam, it's fucking trending. What do you know? Occupied Balam. Da -da -da, done all that. Okay. Head for the dogs at the docks at the end of the harbour.
Oh, I have to leave and come back. Really? Huh? What are you guys doing out there? Oh, really? Well, that was a good waste of about 20 minutes. Hey, money. I thought this was a different screen transition, but it just it was that little bit step too far. I've been told to use this dog to find a loan, but without her scent to go by, what can we do? All I do is just crouch all day and look for clues. A loan's possession, some scent for the dog to go by. Yeah, he was just fishing here. He caught a few and got really excited. Said he was going to eat him right away. Wow. Was just fishing here. Okay. Gotta go to the Dinch's place. Ah! Well, by accident I did another thing so I could get out of town even though I don't want to get out of town. I can remember this actually being pretty frustrating when I was younger. Just now a man came in and asked if he could use the kitchen. I think he cooked some fish. The whole room is filled with a strange odor. Well, that take care of that. Oh, well, now we actually talk to the dog. Like a weird puzzle that's just conveyed really poorly. Like, why give you all these clues to find his nap spot and have it change? Finally, our shift's almost over. The dog's done for today, too. Another hard day's work. Gotta go feed the dog. Did I not get the scent? Boy, searching people sure is tough. You think so, too? Well, you don't... Don't you go back to the hotel, you never know the captain might be there. I thought I got the scent. Obviously not. No, it's not all fucking crazy in here, I must have. Amanda's pissed off because the captain's still not back. She said she's going to lock the captain out of the hotel. And I feel sorry for the captain. It's not like you have groundbreaking news about alone, right? Today's probably a bad day. But wow, the captain set a new slacking off record today. Must have found a new hideout for his naps. Wait, hold on. Oh, captain. I overslept, you know. Obviously there's a timer and I reached it then. So like, is Fujin really mad? Yes, Captain. The commander is furious. You guys help me out here. We've got to calm Fujin down, you know. Raging! Whoa, what are you guys doing here? We're here to liberate Balam, you know. I mean, uh, we're here to liberate Balam. Cypher told us to give you a whooping if we saw you, you know. You soldiers help me out too. Thought you fought both of them. Ah. 
time to do some stealing. Oh. Oh shit, I drew. Should be boosting. True with scroll when I should have attacked. Still. Well, can't draw when they're dead. That was silly of me. Two strengths up. Because I got all... Oh man, Renoa's thing looks fucking awesome. What the hell did I build? Gotta boost that lightning bird. Ah, oh, I fucked up. Looked at chat. Damn it. Oh shit, lightning heals him. Fuck, oh, fuck it. Oh, I stole it. Um, stock thunder. damage to him. Um, too late. Zell has life or full life. Has life, life. Cost protect. I probably should have cast it on Zell.
Dell is probably dead. Yep. Pretty sure I have boosts for brothers. Yeah. AP. Oh yeah, the commander's gonna get a whooping too. I need to heal. So I guess you're the commander. Pack your bags and get the hell out of Balam. Raging, defeated? That's right, baby. Now where's Cypher and the sorceress? You're all going down. Bell, calm down. Ujin looks like you're on your own. Are you still willing to fight? Rage. Wahahaha, she's not alone. Who's there? Major comeback, you know. I'm wide awake now, you know. It's like walk waking up after a satisfying nap, you know. I'm gonna have to use a Mega Phoenix down on Zell if he's still dead. Yep, alright. Well, Mega Phoenix did not do what I thought it did. Why are you always gonna pick on Zell? Draw from that fuck. Alone. Where? 
Wait, we did draw from her and she doesn't have it. Oh yeah, there we go. gives you even less health. doing so little cure to, uh, to me, whereas like for her it was 1.8k. I might have missed something. Not bad, you know. No, don't high potion. Said that already. Actually, car block would be a bad idea. Don't keep repeating yourself. Oh, I fucked it up. Get it to a hundred. Down. Sorry, Fujin, they got me, yeah.
Yes, we got him up. He should be able to take a hit now. Friends like you can. Third faded cycle in a row. Good fucking get from the side to fuck. Fuck. Yeah. I defeated. We got pandemonium too. Combat King. O2. Oh, oh, that's for Thingo. Yeah. Pandemona. I can't even remember what that one does, or what he looks like. Are the two of you taking orders from the sorceress? Negative. The sorceress has nothing to do with us, you know. We're acting on our own. Our own plan. We're on Cephas' side, you know. Cephas side, I mean. They're up to you. That's up to you, but... Enough is enough. This isn't an interne internal garden conflict. We can't back out, you know. Negative. Cypher has a lot of followers, but we're his only friends. We're a posse, you know. The Galbanian soldiers are only listening to Cypher because they fear the sorcerers. Without us, Cypher wouldn't have a posse, you know. You guys stand behind him that much. Tell freaking Cypher to stop this nonsense. Affirmative. We ain't no sellouts. We're behind Cypher all the way, you know. Okay, understood. So you want nothing to do with the garden now. From now on, we're not gonna hold back. I guess that's how it goes. That's what comrades are all about. You're just gonna let them go, Squall? Don't wanna talk anymore, you know. Kinda painful, you know. Wimp. <laughs> Run. I feel sad. Friend or foe, it all comes down to circumstance. That's how we were raised. It's nothing special. Nothing special? Is that true? Then what is this I'm feeling? Let's go. Oh, I wanted to look around the hotel. Where are we going next? Hello, excuse me. What is it? We decided on a destination. Still thinking. Um, can we maybe go to Trabia Garden? It's like, it, in the mountains, so maybe the sorceress would leave it alone. But maybe, you know... I thought it was destroyed by missiles. Oh, I see. That's why. Of course she'd want to go. I'll keep that in mind. Thanks. That's the destination. I don't know where Trabia is, but that's where we're going. Who gets Pandemonia? Um... Alright. There's Travia. I'll let... And we're off! I think there's a way to get back up there onto the near Dollar yet. Let's go straight for Trebia. There's a beach, we might try and get a turtle shell. Oh, there is a beach. Junction. Excel only has two at the moment, yeah. What do you have to learn? Oh, 
fucking strength plus 20%, of course. Alright, turtle. Make yourself appear. That doesn't sound like a turtle. These damn fish. already stole your fins, fish. Just die already, you just like a single fish. All I want to do is find a turtle and steal its shell. Is it that hard? There we go. That kind of stuff I'm gonna kind of do off stream, I guess. Unfortunately. I won't have time between this, my next Final Fantasy stream, and this to uh, grind anything. Fucking okay, let me fight a turtle. Three of them. Let's see what um, Endemona looks like. I have so many fish fins. Well, they're probably gonna die. Kind of move to kill just for three fish. Oh, looking at chat again. Oh, I missed it. You can just put status effects on things. Watch my fucking seed ranking go down. Oh, I got a card. Alright, one more fight. And if it's no turtle, then uh, we'll continue on our way to Trevia. Nah, that's the fish. Run away. Up over here. Mm -hmm. 
Nope, I'm going in the exact opposite way. I get to shoot me yet? I could fucking draw Ultima. Pretty sure I can get to pretty much everywhere now. The few places you can't, that you need the Ragnarok to get to. Odd place for a garden to be. Looks pretty bad. Selfie. Trying to look through the grating. Direct hit. Man, this really pisses me off. I'm going in. Be careful. Alright. Oh, I can't just step out. I was gonna say, I was gonna step out and save, but... In we go. Can't remember what's in here. Squirrel. You guys seen Selfie? You can see her running there. We're looking for Selfie. No shit! Yeah, she ran off ahead. Wonder if there are any monsters around here. Come on, Squirrel, let's hurry after her. Is that in case I want to change my party? I don't want to change my party. Oh. So, you've been looking after Selfie? Selfie's been a great help. Uh. What's wrong? That's not like Squall at all. <laughs> Whatever. So glad I saw Selfie. I feel a lot more cheerful after talking to her. There should be a basketball court in the back. Wait for me there, okay? I want to go catch up with some of my friends. At least they got away. What's this old dude got to say? Young lad, what was your name and number again? You've done a good deed for your academy, Travia Garden. Good deed, you ask? To help rebuild this place. Let's see, for example, have you donated to the Trivia Fund? I'll give you an A. Aw, oh, dude. Graveyard. And something on the ground. I think Renault already has zombies, so... I don't remember what that gives you. Oh, this is a graveyard. Why is there a sniper rifle there? That's weird. Don't go to the right, Delphi. We carried the injured ones out in the car. Me? Nah, I'm not hurt. I'm just sick, exhausted from tending to everyone. That Tomberry King. Take this, GF something bizarre. Someone's delusional. Hey, it's a... Aura! Yes! Best spell. Gee, I wish this facility was a little more reliable. What do they expect the student body committee to do under these remote circumstances? We have to remove this missile as soon as possible. No more threat of an explosion, but if it falls over, it could crush someone. I'm telling you, the Mog Mog Moogle team will make it and probably play the March Mac Chocobos in the finals. Your pronunciation is all wrong. Hilarious that I pronounced, pronounced that wrong. Fuck, man. It's Chocobos, not Chacobo.
Oh, here's the basketball court. We're leaving as soon as Selfie comes back. We're on standby till then. Doesn't seem like the enemy has invaded this garden yet. Now they are on their way. There's a sorceress. We have to find her, Anthony. Talk to Renoa. You know, ever since I met all of you, I've been doing some thinking. Can't stop thinking about it. I can't come up with an answer either. What? You can't... I've been doing some thinking. Can't stop thinking about... Whatever, Renoa. That doesn't make any sense. Why did the sorceress come into the picture all of a sudden? What was she actually waiting for this opportunity? Hmm. Or if she was living a normal life before all of this. Why the search for alone? Alone in fighting Squall back to the past, whereas the sorceress searches for it. Could it be the sorceress is trying to make the journey into the past too? Up over. Gotta do something to show that Sylvie can depend on me. Ah, I like that they have their own kind of like side story where those two are falling for each other. Sorry to keep you waiting. Thanks so much for coming all the way out here, everyone. <laughs> Cheer up, eh? Thanks. Take me with you when you fight the sorceress, okay? I want to get even. I want my revenge. Um. Do we have to fight? Isn't there another way? You know, to avoid any bloodshed. Yo, what the? What are you saying all of a sudden? Maybe someone really smart can come up with a way so we wouldn't have to fight anymore. Getting at. Someone can come up with something. That'd be great. But no one's doing anything. They're all scared, uneasy. All they do is complain. They just pretend to be thinking. He, like, has a lot of inner monologues. They criticize others. In the end, they can't do anything either. For know why all this, all of a sudden, what do you expect from me? I grew up in garden, I'm a seed, do you understand? It's like he's talking to them, but he's not. He's like, well, you have to voice your feelings or else I won't understand. You were part of a resistance movement in Timber, right? Unlike others who were all talk, you took to your weapons and fought. And now you're saying all this, what happened to you? I guess, I'm getting scared. Sometimes, when I'm with all of you, I feel like we're on the same wavelength, you know? When the battles start happening, it's different. Everyone's tempo seems to pick up, and I get left behind. I try to catch up, but it's no use. How far is everyone going? I can't hear anyone. Once I catch up, I wonder, is everyone safe? Will they welcome me with open arms? Is everyone okay? We all make it back together. When I start thinking like that, I know I understand. One might not be there. The one you love may disappear before your very eyes. It's tough when you lo live your life thinking that way, but that's why I fight. When I was a little kid, I was about four or so. I was in an orphanage. Plenty of kids, all with no parents. It was around the end of the Sorceress War, so I guess it couldn't be helped. Anyway, that's where I was. And out of all the kids, there was one... Blech. Out of all the kids there, one was very special to me. Guy Irvy, wanna play? I really like this girl. It made me so happy just talking to her. Selfie, what you playing? Oh. That often is just stone house? Guessed it. An old house made of stone by the ocean. You guessed it. I knew right away when we first met. Hey, why didn't you tell us? Yeah, why didn't you tell us? Because you two seem to have forgotten. This kind of sucked that I was the only one who remembered. 
Funky little selfie. Bossy little Quisty. That is just so weird. Huh? Hey, do you guys remember setting up fireworks? That was... This way. I am um, Ghost Squall. Oh, I can go in here. This, Ellie. I can't run though, I've got to walk everywhere. It's like, really creepy. This isn't here, where's this? The white squall's just like, tiny child standing there. Like horror movie doll thing. Now we'll go out and look for fireworks. Not like that. It's very Charlie Brown with that shirt though. This, where'd you go? You don't like me anymore? What a shameful sight. Ball shirts! I can run now. How about this? Yeah. The ocean, the lighthouse. Bruno was just like standing there while they reminisce about this. We did set off fireworks. Yo! Kids aren't supposed to play with fireworks. I'm telling, I'm gonna tell on you. That sounds like so. Cry, baby, Zell. Go back to bed. I remember this. Does that mean I was there too? We all got in big trouble. Then what about my parents in Balam? The Dinches in Balam must have adopted you. Yeah, that's probably it. Ah, uh, was there? Yo, come on, stop it. Matt Finn, help. Cry baby Zell. Who's that? Na 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 na. Stop teasing me, Cypher. Oh my goodness. Cypher, my arch enemy. Wow, he was there too. Well. Cypher. Cypher was always Cypher. Irvine, sorry, don't remember you. Chris, this, I think you were difficult to deal with. Elvi, always full of energy. Zell, always crying and screaming. Ah, uh, I can't go out that door. Ooh, spirit me got 6,000 go gil. Cypher was there too. Except for Renoa, we were all there. Hey, that means... Yeah. I was there too. I... Yes. I was always waiting for Sis to come back. I'm all alone. But I'm doing my best. I'll be okay without you, Sis. I'll be able to take care of myself. I didn't turn out okay at all. <laughs> Easy can admit that. Sis Ellie. Ellie, alone. So alone was Sis. She was a bit older than us, and we all used to call her Sis. Mrs. Cell, Selfie, Irvine, Cypher, Alone, and myself. Yeah. Not sure what the meaning behind all this is, but we were definitely together. You mean Sis is alone? She's the one that takes us back to Laguna's period. She said she wanted to change the past. I don't know why. There can only be one reason for that. She must not be happy with the present. 
If that's the case, I'm definitely up for helping her. Part of our orphanage gang. Pew pew! He didn't even remember who she was. Hey, Selfie, that goes for you too. Pretty scary we've forgotten all these things. So, Ma and Pa aren't my real parents. I wonder where the orphanage is. Hmm, so Sis was alone, eh? Everyone was fond of Sis, but you, Squall, you kept hogging her for yourself. You sure have a good memory. This is really strange. I don't think I was adopted because of the way I am. Probably the same with Cypher, too. You two must have been at Garden by the age of five or so. Even so, he's never mentioned anything about growing up in an orphanage. And nothing about this has ever crossed my mind when I see him either. Don't you find that odd? That is strange. In my case, I had loads and loads of fun after going to Travia. Probably why I forgot all about my childhood, that's what I think. But I don't know what's up with you guys, it's so odd that you would forget. I remember, yes I remember now. Things didn't work out too well at my new home. I came to Garden at the age of 10. That was when I first noticed Cypher and Squall. Cypher and Squall were always fighting. Yeah, Quistus always used to break us up. Yeah, that's right. Cypher was a kid who always needed to be the center of attention. Squall always used to ignore him. But eventually they would end up fighting. Squall could have easily walked away from it, but always took up the challenge. He should have just ignored him, but Squall, on missing tears, would say, Gotta do my best by myself, or else I won't be able to see Sis. I guess I was trying to take Sis, I mean, alone's place. I tried, but to no avail. That's probably it. Even after becoming an instructor, I couldn't stop thinking about Squall. I thought it was love, I had to hide my feelings because I was an instructor. But I've come to realize it wasn't. It was my childhood feelings as a big sister that lingered. Okay. Oh well. Hmm, I can't remember. The orphanage was located. Yo, this is getting out of hand. We've forgotten way too much. We talked to Quizdis. Seemed like she was shocked. Going to. I was talking to everyone else first. I misunderstood, look. Actually, I had completely given up when Renoa came into the picture. <laughs> hey. It must be the same for Cypher. I'm sure Cypher has forgotten his childhood too. But whenever he sees squalls, his inner feelings start to boil and... That's why he's always picking fights with you, Squall. Why is it that we forgot? We grew up together as kids, how's that possible? How about this? The price we pay for using the GF. The GF rides us in power, but the GF makes its own place inside our brain. So you're saying that the area is where our memories are stored? No. That's just... that's just a rumor. GF critics are spreading. But if we keep relying on the GF, we won't be able to remember a lot of things. There's no way Headmaster Sid would allow such a dangerous thing. And how is it that I remember while everyone else has forgotten? Well, in my case, I hadn't junctioned to GF until recently. That's why I remembered a lot more than you guys. How about you, Selfie? Your first experience with the GF was when you came to Balam, right? Yeah. Gave up our memories in exchange for power. Because of the GF that we forget? Is that why other forces refrain from using GF? There are some things we're better off not remembering, especially when you your life revolves around battles. That's kind of true, I guess. <sighs> I have a confession to make. When I was 12, I went on an outdoor training session. I found a GF inside one of the monsters I defeated. I junctioned that GF for a while, so I have experience with GF too. But, but it's really weird, I can't remember the name of that GF. Must be the GF's fault. What should we do? What should we do? Nothing. What do you mean nothing? So what do you want to do? You want to stop using GF now? As long as we continue fighting, we're indebted to the power of that GF. There's a price I have to pay for that, I'll gladly pay it. Hey, I know, let's all keep a diary. That way we'll always have something to remind us. Are you sure that's what you want? 
Maybe that's for the best. Yeah, I don't care if I forget about my childhood when Cypher used to pick on me. What's important to me now is having the power to protect the, my parents in Valon. They adopted me. There's no way I'm letting go of that power. Hey. You all remember Matron? Who's always wearing black? Let's see. Matron dressed in black. She's the... Very kind, long black hair. Yes, I really admired her. Wait, I just pictured her face and see a resemblance. Matron, they look alike. Look alike. Nah, that's not it. Matron's name is Edia Kramer. Matron is Sorceress Edia. Matron? Sorceress Edia? Why is the Matron? Why? Wondering why Matron would take over a country or fire missiles and whatnot? At this point, we probably wouldn't comprehend it even if we talked about it. You're probably right. Hear me out. Seed and garden were all Matron's idea, right? I'm not a seed, but I share the same feelings with all of you. Seeds are supposed to fight the sorceress, right? This is strange. That's right. It was when I was being tortured by Seedfer that he wanted to know what seed was. Matron should know, but Matron is sorceress idiot. There's no denying that. What did this all mean? Squall, you listening? They're like, this is what I wanted to say. I had to change location to get to the Let's see, oh yeah. I understand what Renault is saying. I understand, but I'm still gonna, still, I'm gonna fight. I want to stay true to everything I've stood for. I'm sure it's the same for everyone. That's why I thought it'd be best if everyone knew we would have to face Matron. You've all heard this before. Our life has infinite possibilities. I don't believe that one bit. There weren't many paths for me to choose. Sometimes there would only be one. From the limited possibilities I face, the choices I made have brought me this far. That's why I value the path I chose. I want to hold true to the path that had, had to be taken. I know your opponent is Matron, whom we all love very much. You might lose something very important on account of the GF, but I don't mind. It's not like I drifted here on the tides of fate. I'm here because I chose to be here. And more importantly, we all grew up together, but due to various circumstances, we were all separated. As a kid, you couldn't really go out on your own. There was no other path to take. All I did was just cry. Man, this is a beach, but... Oh, back in the real world. But, somehow, we're together again, just like old times, though a lot changed. We're not kids anymore. We're strong enough to take care of ourselves. Make our own decisions. We're confronting a big one right now. Do we fight Matron or not? I say we fight. Shoot for a common goal. Hey... At least it'll keep us together a little longer. Yeah, let's do it. We can't run from her for the rest of our lives. It's just such a bummer. I can't believe we have to fight Matron. I know, but Cell's right. We can't run from her forever. Renoa. It's up to you. We're gonna fight. I think it's the only way we can move on with our lives. If that makes any sense at all, come with us. I'm sure that's what everybody wants. Look, look. It's snowing. A gift from the fairies. Yo, you want to go check out Edia's orphanage? I wonder what it's like now. You might find a clue. Clue, you mean as to why Matron turned out like this? Probably has to do with something that happened in the past, but the past is the past, it's over, done with. Despite what truth we find, it's not going to change the present, but I want to see too. I don't know what we'll find, but let's head for Edia's house. Renoa didn't answer the question, she's just like, okay. Oh, we're not done yet. 
Guess that's it. We're fighting. You guys are fearless. Fearless? I don't think that's quite right. If you think too hard, you become lost. I think that's what everyone's afraid of. I wish we didn't have to fight either. Man, it really has the let's switch your party up thing happen quite a bit. Um, we're gonna drive a little forward, jump out, save. Because what I'm about to do might cause the game to crash. <laughs> That's gonna end this portion for YouTube. Uh, so thank you for watching YouTube, if you are watching. Um, I'm gonna keep doing recordings for another part, just I don't really want to do more than three hour parts in VODs. So yeah, thank you for watching YouTube, and I will see you next time.